Good win tonight. How does that leave you all feeling? Good, good. You know, you you on the back of promotion to two very tough games. We we've been looking forward f forward to this part of the the calendar, playing playing against the two competitors, Middlesbrough and Sheffield United, and to come away with six points and and especially um, you know the second half tonight. It, it was yeah, I'm, I'm I'm really happy. I think we're all delighted. Given how emotionally draining last <clears throat> Friday could have been, how happy were you with the energy levels tonight? Yeah, to be honest, the first half was a little bit of a mishit for me. Um, I thought we've been better than that. And and again, not <coughs> I'm sorry, full of a cold. And again, no, yeah, <laughs> no, um, no cri criticism in terms of effort, but, but probably concentration and, and a little bit of quality. And then um, at half time, I think we were very clear on, on, on the fact that, look, you know, we, we, we've We've got to set the standards to the normal standards for us. And then in the second half, I thought, I'm not saying in the first half Sheffield was better, but we were not our best. And then in the second half, uh, despite Sheffield being with 10 men, I thought we uh, we managed it really well and we were we were dangerous and, and, and we're happy for Yowie as well with the two goals. Let's talk about that that change then at half time. Um, he's not scored here for a long time. So where did they come from? Where did those goals and what instructions did you give him to come out second half? <clears throat> no, look... He always an experienced player. He knows he knows where he needs, he needs to be in the box. I think, <clears throat> for my side, it just felt with with the possession we had and and the fact that the game obviously had changed. These were the players that were that were needed for that moment. And, and you know, Yowie Yowie delivered, and we're happy for him. How's Josh? Yeah, Brownie. I don't know. I, um, I can keep complaining about the astroturfs and everything on the pitches, but it happens on our pitch this time. Um, it's something we'll look into, um, but it, 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 should, it shouldn't be too bad. And just finally, I know we weren't allowed to use the P word last time, but in terms of potentially winning the title, we know now that two wins <laughs> will do it. Yeah. yeah, can we talk about that? Um, yeah, I, I think we we've got to look even beyond. You know, I I, I know every game is difficult, especially if you drop drop your levels a little bit. So as long as we maintain our levels, I think we you know we should be. We should be setting the bar as high as we can, and and it starts with Reading next weekend, and uh, and that'll be our priority. So is that bar potentially whatever you can get past a hundred points? It's six games, six games. So why why would we do anything any different? Of course, we 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 have to give some game time to some other players as well, not just for results, but also because we want to have another look at them. We want to make sure as well that they. They're rewarded for the support they've they've given the squad. We've got a big squad. That's why we're here. Um, but in the end, even so, I think um, every 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 player we've got, every team we put out there, should be able to have results, and and and, and it could be a special season. Well done tonight. Thank Get you well. very much. Thank you. Yeah, and happy birthday. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> Johan, so mate, that wasn't it. How are you feeling? Yeah, feeling really good. Uh, just helping the team. Uh, yeah, disappointed to be on the bench, but uh, that's how it is. We played two days ago uh, for an old body like mine. Sometimes you need a rest, and uh, just to come on half time and, and help the team is is obviously brilliant. What were your instructions? Yeah, just play my play my game in the position I came in in the, in the midfield. Try to make, make runs in behind and and try to be in the box. And and luckily the ball dropped for me twice there and, and t two nice finishes. Goals as well as your first goal of 2023 and your first goal here. Since February 2021, that's yeah, some time. Been, so where did yeah, they both been, come from? Yeah, it's been way too long. And uh, yeah, as I said, I mean, I, I've been trying to contribute with uh, assists and goals, and and I've been been more assists than goals this season. So yeah, hopefully uh, I can I can add a few more goals this season. But yeah, nice to just as I said, just ni nice to help the team, and especially against against Sheffield United. They obviously beat us in the in the first game, and and we wanted to get our revenge, and we and we got that. Was that in the back of your mind? Because sometimes when I asked that question, it was like, oh, no, it wasn't. But was it there? Because that was yeah, the last defeat I mean, as well, yeah. wasn't it? And when you lose to a team, and especially a team that's close to you, you want to you wanna get one back, definitely. And that, that was in the back of our mind, and, and, and we did so. So so good, good job for everybody. I was talking to the manager before about the emotions and sometimes the, the energy that you use in such an emotional night as it was at, at Middlesbrough on Friday night. Did that have any sort of impact on, on tonight's game? Yeah, possibly. I mean, uh, Friday is, is not long not long ago. Uh, the emotions of the game, getting promoted to the Premier League, all the celebrations. I mean, it's a, it's a short turnaround as well uh, to a game on, on a Monday. So, 
of course it could have an effect but uh, again we we showed that we can win in, in different ways uh, we weren't great first half we were a bit better second half and they were obviously down to 10 men and it's, it's always that it's difficult to break down when they they have a low block so yeah we always find our way and we did that today and talking of celebrations your Icelandic clap was ringing around <laughs> turf more again tonight do you can you sense that when that's happening yeah it was it was, it was quite nice to see uh, obviously we did it against against Middlesbrough and uh, you never know it might come out the last game of the of the season you never know so I'm going to ask you then I mean that's if you win the next two you are officially champions is that in your I know we weren't talking about promotion but mm. can we talk about the championship yeah, we want to go for everything. We want to have a silverware in our hands. Uh, we Even we want to go for the record's points as well. We know we can get that. So we are a team. We are relentless. Uh, the manager is relentless. He's on us every every single day, every single moment. And we want to go for everything. And that's obviously lifting the trophy. And hopefully we can also break the record. Come on. Well done tonight. Thank you. Thanks, Joey. Thank you. <laughs>